Let's talk about places that you would use a needle up or needle down function. And I wanna show you something cool this machine will do. We're working with the Bernina 570, and one of my recent projects is doing decorative stitches on curved blocks. So stopping with the needle down and a slight pivot, every time I need to just get that stitch to just kind of slightly curve around, I don't have to worry about it. The machine does it practically for me. So so there's multiple ways to set the needle to stop in the down position. So number one, when you start to sew and you just step on the foot control, that foot comes down on your fabric. Right now we have the needle stopping in the up position. Now I point here because this is where you can change it to stop in the down position permanently. That means instead of using this button, this one's almost like just a quick like down and then a quick up. So this is just a one time, oh, I need to just go one more um, half a stitch and without stepping on your foot control, you can activate that with your finger. But when this is set to the down position, which it is, then when I stop sewing, the machine stops with the needle in the fabric. Now I'm going to show you one more thing because right now I have this set for the hover option. And so when it's set to stop down, I can slightly adjust my fabric to uh, go around the curves. And this is from our Bernina Stitching Cosmos online class. Everything is done around a curve. We have bias galore, but with the right stabilizer and fun techniques and accessory feet that go, we go through, uh, this is probably one feature that I just gotta keep on on the machine all at once. Now, one more use for your foot control. So if you've ever noticed that your foot control has a little picture of a needle up down feature as well on it, this is the heel. So the proper way for your foot to be resting on here is with your toes all the way at the top. So your heel of your foot can rock back. And when you rock back, and I'm gonna just push with my thumbs, is just to go ahead and you'll see that the machine just like the button here, will take a half a stitch. Now, why did Bernina put that on their foot control? So number one, there is so many times where you don't have a hand to let go of your fabric for that button. So why not keep your hands on deck and use your foot as an, an option for that. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna to take you into the settings where you can set it. So if your machine currently doesn't have that hover feature on like mine does, uh, go into the home button, go into the settings, touch the straight and zigzag box, Look for the picture of the hand, because we're gonna be touching a, a button, and it's the button for the needle up down feature. So in here, and I'm gonna tell you something about this area. There are times where I do want my foot to hover, and there's times I don't. I'm about a 50-50, because my next project, I'm not going around curves, so I want it to stop lifting. So I'm in here turning it off when I want it off, and turning it back on when I want it on. So if your machine, probably if it hasn't been turned on uh, straight from the factory, it is set to stop in the down position. So as we sew, we can find that, oh, I'd have to come out of this to show you, that we could actually, when we sew, the foot stays down like a normal sewing machine. So let's do that again, touch the home, touch the gears, touch the first one, look for the hand, and look for needle down. Now, there's two options here, a little lift and then a major lift. So both of those are available to you. So if you've never turned this on, go ahead and try it and see how wonderful this feature is when you have your machine set for the needle in the down position. So just take a stitch. I've gone ahead and switched it back so it will do my hovering for me, which is something that I use a lot. So if you're interested in using more of your decorative stitches, you definitely check out our free videos that you can watch to see if the Bernina Stitching Cosmos course is right for you. We've got all those links in the description below. We have tons more videos for you to check out on the Bernina 570 Quilters Edition for both the sewing and the embroidery side of this beautiful machine.